chat is about Virgil van Dijk. A hat-trick in his last game. Will he prosper once more? We'll have the action on EA TV. Well, you could almost put this scene on a postcard. Sun shining brightly at Anfield. Absolutely perfect. I'm Derek Ray, joined by Lee Dixon in the commentary position. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It is Liverpool, and they take on Fulham. Yeah, thanks, Derek. Should be a good game, this one. I always wanted to start the game on the front foot. Fast play, force the opposition to respond. Hopefully we get that from the start of this match. Oxlade-Chamberlain. Mo Salah knows how to light up any game, Lee. Well, he's got amazing finishing ability. And when a player's got that, it means you have to go that extra yard tighter. And when you do that, you leave space behind you. So it puts the defender in two minds. Let's take a look at the Liverpool starting 11. Alisson gets the nod in goal. Mohamed Salah plays with Jadan Shakiri on the flanks. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. And this is the team Fulham have selected. And this is a formation most people in the game are very familiar with nowadays. Yeah, most coaches are adopting this formation. What it does give you is two holding players in front of the back four to protect them. But it also gives you three supporting players to that central striker. The fans are always part of the story here at Anfield. And they get underway. Slade Chamberlain onto De Jong Alexander Arnold Salah excellent block Bobby Reid now that'll be a free kick Paris Saint-Germain have been busy in the transfer market. The contract situation has been signed and sealed, and he could be available as early as their next game, Lee. Well, Derek, I've heard the fees around £75 million. That's the type of money you have to pay for quality these days. The market's gone a little bit mad. Are you wasting your money? I'd say not. Top player. Onguisa. And Mitrovic. Lukman. Interception to snuff out the danger. And the emphasis is on creativity. Well, not covering himself in glory defensively. Must take the lead here. Courageous goalkeeping, but he's got the ball. Well, you have to be brave, don't you? Diving at the feet of a player like that. Good goalkeeping. Fabinho. Andrew Robertson. 
Frankie de Jong. Alexander Arnold. Salah. Top class defending. Able to close down the shot. Liverpool have given it away. Lukman. Well, attacking possibilities. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. And just narrowly wide in the end. Oxlade Chamberlain. Here's Robertson. Fabinho. De Jong. Frankie De Jong. And can they prize them open now? A sloppy pass. Origi. Oxley Chamberlain. And now Shakiri. And the Liverpool throw in forthcoming. Options in the centre. De Jong. Oxley Chamberlain. Promising looking ball. De Jong. Here's Fabinho. Accurate pass upon accurate pass. Lovely ball over the top. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. Andrew Robertson. Alexander Arnold. Fabinho now. Oxley Chamberlain. Shakiri. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. It's a good Liverpool move in the making. Robertson well, simply couldn't beat the first defender. Liverpool corner given. Over it comes. He succeeded in getting his fist to it. And a goal at Stamford Bridge, I'm being told. But for which team? Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Chelsea. 23 minutes played. 1-0. Regular updates from Alan McAnally along the way. Really sitting deep now. That could be problematic. Oxlade Chamberlain couldn't keep it. Mitrovic. And on the ball, Kearney. Doing well to keep possession. The referee knew that was foul play, but advantage it is. Clear foul play, and as a result, a free kick forthcoming. Well, the danger is still there. Takes the shot. Not far away at all with the volley. Well, to catch it like that, you've got to have really good technique. And oh, so close. De Jong. Excellent vision. And still danger here. Alexander Mitrovic. Lukman. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Lukman. They could nudge in front and able to close down the shot. And a close offside decision as they were threatening.
Origi. De Jong. Spot on with that tackle. This might be ideal for the counter. Defenders need to cover. Tom Kearney. It might be on for them. Crossing possibilities. Kearney. Ongisa. Having won the ball back, they might be able to profit. Fulham totally taking control of this game in the last 15 minutes. Their play really deserves a goal, but you don't always get what you deserve in this game. We know that, Derek. Tete. Menzi. Oh, that's a fine pass. Electing to cross into the centre. No nonsense clearance. But I can tell you a goal has been scored at Stamford Bridge. Let's hear about it from Alan McAnally. It's a second goal for Chelsea. 40 minutes played, 2-0. Thanks very much as always, Alan. Cross towards that far post. Well, it might still work out for them. Threat over for now, it seems. And a throw-in forthcoming. Oxlade Chamberlain. He's lost it. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? End product or not? In behind for him to chase. Well, he certainly wasn't offside by a mile. Phillips Alexander Arnold This is Salah Origi Getting forward Going about his defensive business With a minimum of fuss Racing forward Trying to catch them out Chances on Surely And there it is 1-0 The efforts have been rewarded and look at the celebrations. Well, here it is again. It's all about the pace in transition. They were so quick to get out from the back. And he chooses to use power in the finish. Not much chance for the keeper when it's hit that hard. Well, the action continues. Is there to be a response from Liverpool now? There needs to be. And that brings to an end the first half here at Anfield. Well, all in all, it's been a struggle for Mohamed Salah to make his presence felt today, Lee. Yeah, well, the stats don't lie. Not enough has been done by the team, and he has to take some of the blame for that. Too easy to mark would suggest to me he needs to run around a little bit more. It's not rocket science, Derek. anticipated plenty of talking points so far and now the second half is underway and possession given away Alexander Arnold Roberto Firmino Diogo Jota Salah and he's made headway. 
Oh, a goal for Liverpool, who are now on level terms. Well, let's take a look at this replay. The difference between a good player and some of the best players is they don't need to take a touch. Gets his shot away, first time. Nothing else matters but concentrating on that ball. So, a level contest, 1-1. One, one. Mendy. Here's Adamola Lukman. And Mohamed Salah now. They could nudge in front. Oh, that's a fine save. And it could be a chance for Liverpool to take the lead from a corner. Go, go. Over it comes. I must admit, I thought he was going to score with that header. Yeah, it was a quality cross and he gets up well and it's just wide. Well, he's disappointed with the fact they haven't taken the lead, but he'd be pleased with the way they're playing. Onguisa. Mitrovic. Now oh, showing excellent vision. Mitrovic. And foiled by Van Dijk. Mendy, Onguisa, Tom Kearney, crossing opportunity, still looking for space, Onguisa, and putting his body on the line. Roberto Firmino. Credit to them for winning back possession. Onguisa. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. Well, not hard to read that pass. Mitrovic. It could be up for grabs. Menzi. Reed. Interception to snuff out the danger. Getting news of a goal on the Chelsea game. Alan? It's a third goal for Chelsea. 60 minutes played, 3-0. Thank you, Alan McAnally. Firmino. Jota. And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. Really good reading of the game to win possession back. Diogo Jota. Salah. And this is Diogo Jota now. Fabinho. Here's Salah. Roberto Firmino might fancy this. Punching it clear. Fabinho. De Jong, well, to deny him from point-blank range like that, brilliant. Well, really, really strong goalkeeping. Spread himself, used all of his body, really good save. And the substitution will occur now. And he's fired over the corner, but fisted away by the goalkeeper. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. And players waiting in the centre. Fabinho. Firmino. Well, real difficulty keeping the ball. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. Salem Aldosseri. And what can they do to stop him running at them? A meaty but fair challenge, and it will be a throw-in. 
Well, that's a completely wasted throw in. Roberto Firmino. Jota. And the cross goes in. He's been admonished by the referee. He's now got to walk something of a tightrope. Yeah, he knows exactly where he stands. Look at the referee, how he's told him off there. No yellow card, but certainly knows what the referee's thinking. A goal! Accurate from the spot! Well, as we see it again, I can tell you his nerves will have been jangling, but he kept his nerve. Really good penalty. Slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Diogo Jota. Liverpool in a position of menace. Salah. Turning inside. Where's he going to go? The keeper was never likely to be in trouble then. Alexander Arnold. Firmino. Great challenge. He got nothing but ball. The referee's letting it go as they keep the ball. Tom Kearney. Good vision. Can he get onto this? Salah. And take it away. Onguisa. They are making headway, but really they need a goal with time not on their side. He's protecting it effectively. Well, he's almost been hassled out of play here. And the referee blows for a foul. Substitution for Liverpool. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes. And now both sides will make personnel switches. Number 14, Lookman. Henderson. Michael Hector. And now Kenny Tete. Salem Aldosari. He's in behind. And the flag has gone up here. Offside the decision. Robertson. Well, just listen to the Liverpool fans. The crowd very much behind them right now. It's been a tough game, but not long to go to see this out. The cross is on. Not an especially strong challenge. No nonsense clearance. And they know they need to stop him. This could square the game. And he clears it out of harm's way. Salah. And five minutes to go. Mendy. On to Anderson. Tete. Down by a goal. This could be the final opportunity to snatch something. Can they get in behind them? Gisa. Virgil van Dijk with the block. A corner then, and with time running out, they've got to ask questions. And time for the change now. He's driven in the corner. Well, he could really get at the opposition. 
And really effective shielding under pressure. McMahon. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. One minute remaining. Shakiri. Frankie de Jong. Encouraging move from Liverpool. And he did well to cut it out. Salem al -Dossari. Really good reading of the game to win possession back. And the referee blows for full time. This goes down as a Liverpool victory and their fans entitled to be happy about that, Lee. Well, wins like that when there's nothing between the sides seem more valuable somehow. Really tight game that was. Another more than effective night's work for Mo Salah. Lee, your thoughts on his performance? Well, he's always a danger, isn't he? No more so when he grabbed that goal. He never disappoints me when I watch him. He's just too good, simple. The fans are always part of the story here at Anfield, and they get underway. And just narrowly wide in the end. Takes the shot. Not far away at all with the volley. Well, to catch it like that, you've got to have really good technique. And oh, so Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Chances on. Surely. And there it is. 1-0. Their efforts have been rewarded. And look at the celebrations. Diogo Jota. Salah. And he's made headway. Oh, a goal for Liverpool, who are now on level terms. They could nudge in front. Oh, that's a fine save. And it could be a chance for Liverpool. Over it comes. I must admit, I thought he was going to score with that header. Yeah, it was a quality cross and he gets up well. And he